AFER's marriage lawsuit in Virginia is picking up speed with a faster schedule and new parties. We have new lawsuits this week in four different states, and the young Republicans in another state break ranks with the state party to endorse the freedom to marry. For the American Foundation for Equal Rights, I'm Matt Baum, and welcome to Marriage Newswatch for March 17, 2014. Big news in Virginia this week, a judge has granted AFER's request for an expedited schedule, which means that we'll see opening briefs later this month, replies in April, and oral arguments at a hearing in May. And that's not all. The judge has allowed plaintiffs in a second Virginia case to intervene in AFER's. Those parties can now lend their support to upholding last month's victory. But as the Virginia case speeds up, a lawsuit in Nevada is slowing down. The Ninth Circuit has indefinitely postponed oral arguments in Sevchik v. Sandoval with no explanation. Meanwhile, in Utah, plaintiffs in Evans v. Utah argued last week that the state should recognize the licenses issued after a pro-equality ruling in December. A ruling in that case could come at any time, and the Tenth Circuit will hear an appeal of that prior pro-equality ruling uh, in less than a month. We'll have a decision soon in a Michigan marriage case. With the trial concluding last week, the judge has indicated a time frame of about two weeks to issue a ruling. And we have six additional lawsuits to watch as of this week. The first is in Florida, where there were already two separate marriage cases. We have a new marriage lawsuit this week in South Carolina, another new one in Arizona, and three new marriage lawsuits in Indiana. The Oregon Young Republicans have voted overwhelmingly to support marriage equality despite opposition from the state party. That's consistent with national trends. New Pew research shows that 61% of Republicans under 30 support the freedom to marry. That's compared to just 27% of Republicans over 50. Those are the headlines this week. Subscribe here on YouTube to stay up to date on all these stories. For the American Foundation for Equal Rights, I'm Matt Baum. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next week.